settled down for a long winter's nap. When out in the lawn there arose such a clatter, I sprang from my bed to see what was the matter. Away to the window I flew like a flash, tore open the shutters and threw up the sash. The moon on the breast of the new fallen snow gave the luster of midday to objects below. When what with my wandering eyes should appear but a miniature sleigh in a tiny reindeer. With a little old driver so lively and quick, I knew in a moment it must be St. Nick. More rapid than eagles his coursers they came, and he whistled and shouted and called them by name. Now Dasher, now Dancer, now Prancer and Vixen, on, Comet, on, Cupid, on, Daughter and Blitzen, to the top of the porch, to the top of the wall. Now dash away, dash away, dash away all, as dry leaves that before the wild hurricane fly, when they meet with an obstacle, mount to the sky. So up to the housetop the coursers they flew with the sleigh full of toys and St. Nicholas too. And then in a twinkling I heard on the roof the prancing and mowing of each little hoof. As I drew in my head and was turning around, down the chimney St. Nicholas came with a bound. He was dressed all in fur from his head to his foot. His clothes were all tarnished with ashes and soot. A bundle of toys he had flung on his back, and he looked like a peddler just opening his pack. You know what? What? You know, there was a shipping on a magazine. It was your grandmother. I think it's your grandmother. Yeah. Okay. This is from your BB and Papa, though. Stockings, then turned with a jerk, then laying his finger aside of his nose and 